another day at Goodwill. Some Kate Spade, some Lucky Brand, just some amazing handbags. Oh yeah, it was a good trip. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming back. Are you coming back every week? Like if you are, you're amazing. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. And please, by all means, leave comments below whether you like this video, whether you want to see something different. Let me know how I'm doing. I can take criticism as long as it's semi-criticism. <laughs> anyway, if you're new to this channel, my name is Julie. I go as Jules Gems. I'm an online reseller on eBay, on Poshmark. I go treasure hunting for clothes, shoes, accessories, housewares for men, women, children, gender neutral, no gender at all. You name it, I'll grab it and I'm having a blast doing it. So thank you for joining. I'm gonna show you some stuff that I went to Goodwill for just another day, just going in to see what they had and it did not disappoint, not even a little bit. So let's get right into it because I got two pairs of boots that are off the charts. Good old lucky brand. I happen to have a pair of these boots, almost identical. These ones are suede. The ones that I have are leather, um, a big chunky heel, a nice round toe, a cute buckle on the side. They zip on both sides. This is a size nine and a half. I'm a 10, or these would be mine. They are so cute. If you have not ever worn Lucky Brand boots, you need these. If you have, you know you need these. This is the most perfect boot if you're wearing with long jeans, if you're wearing with skinny jeans, if you wear skinny jeans and roll it up a little bit with some cute scrunchy socks, which is my signature look. Um, you can wear these with a jean skirt, a denim skirt, a stretchy short skirt. These boots are to die for. Nine and a half, lucky brand, going up on Poshmark. I also scored on some Kate Spade boots, and these are so beautiful. So they're just a classic black tall boot. It does have a, a three inch heel, but it's a thick, chunky three inch heel. It's got a round toe, but it's got these beautiful gold embellishments right here and the inside is red they're absolutely beautiful they're pull on made in italy eight and a half or i'm sorry uh kate spade new york eight and a half leather tall boots they are to die for minimal wear and i do not believe she makes this particular style anymore so cute eight and a half Kate Spade, gotta have them. And that was it on the shoes. Normally I get a lot more shoes, but I found this cute hat as I was walking out, I grabbed it. It doesn't fit my big old head. Um, I don't know what size it is, but it's little. <laughs> but how cute is that? It's made in Italy. It's a Milani and it was designed in Italy and it's 100% straw. But it's got that really cute beading. Oh, I love this. I think it's such a cool look, especially in the summer, during festival season, during country um concerts or just being cute so that is going to go up on both sides ah, handbags oh this does not have a brand and i don't care and if this stays up in my closet or on ebay for too long i'm gonna keep it so it's got a strap and then it's got these uh, gold metal handles and it snaps closed this purse has never been used this is brand new and it's got a suede lining so it's all leather it's got a suede lining it does not have any kind of branding on it so i think it's probably just one of those boutique uh handbags but it's a pale pale pink it's a wonderful tote size with the shoulder strap and it's in perfect condition and I absolutely love this bag and it might be mine if somebody doesn't grab it um, in the next couple of months. So that'll be going up on both sites. And I couldn't believe this. I, I saw it 
And I'm like, I don't know that brand. And because of the chain, it's very traditional. It's a Rebecca Minkoff. Yeah. Sorry, I'm hooked. Um, but I saw the chain and then I grabbed it and I went, ooh, I know that, right? So that's her signature chain. It's a white leather bucket bag with the chain. It's got the fringe and then it has metallic balls in both gold and silver on the fringe. You can wear it just like this as a shoulder bag or you can go one strap and make it a crossbody, right? So you can go just like that. It is so beautiful. The leather is so thick, so heavy. Um, it does need a good leather cleaning from your, your local shoe repair. They'll clean it up a little bit. It, I mean, not, when I say cleaning, it just, it just needs a good scrubbing, but I'm not gonna do that because I'm not a professional. Shoe repair places make this look brand new again. Um, and I highly suggest it. It's not expensive at all. So this is beautiful. This will be going up on both sides. I also got this awesome fabric woven backpack, completely boho, very beachy. I, my God, I wanna keep this too. I'm dying with what I'm finding because it's so me. So it's a drawstring here, but it also buckles. So it buckles closed, which is nice. It's a really thick woven uh, material and it does have adjustable straps, but what a fun backpack that is. Really, really cute. I will put that up on both sides. It does not have a brand either, um, but who cares? It's so cute. So I love that. Ooh, getting wild here. <laughs> um, I got this gorgeous leather belt with a snakeskin pattern. It's brand new with tags. Um, it's brand spanking new. It's Banana Republic and it retailed for $98. It's a small, it's got about a two inch thickness to it. It's got a gold buckle. Um, oh, I love a good thick belt. I am all about that. When you're wearing um, solids, like maybe red or, um, or black and you throw on an animal print belt with it, it looks to die for. So this is really cute. This will go up on both sides. And then I found this adorable skirt. I always pick up uh, skirts that have a fun pattern. This is a real size uh, 20W, and it, it does not have a stretch band. It's got that nice double band that falls nicely on the hips, but it zips on the side. It's got flowers and circles. It's a really fun graphic print. It's gonna come either right at the top of the knee or to the bottom of the knee, depending on your height. But I love a good printed black black skirt and this one is really cute. The material is lovely. It is barely worn. It is 97% cotton and 3% uh, spandex so it is going to be very comfortable. There isn't anything you can't wear with this. I would tie up a white men's shirt a little bit and, and put that on maybe with some red jewelry um, just for fun or you can do a royal blue top with it. Super cute. I love that. And then I got this beautiful dress. I got this just because it's so my style um, for when I when I worked in the corporate America. It's a canard, it's a size 10. It uh, feels like satin, even though it's polyester, cotton, and spandex, but it feels like a thick satin. It's animal print. It zips up the back. It is so adorable. It could be done for formal. Um, it could be done for um, evening attire, work attire, you name it. It is so beautiful, so flattering. Those sleeves, the gathering here. I don't know if this is your type of dress and, and if you've never tried something like this on, trust me when I say it's very flattering. So that was really beautiful, so I picked that up. And that's it for adult clothing. I grabbed some kid stuff. I got some Twinkle Toe Skechers for little girls in sequins with bows. They are brand new. They've never been worn and they're Skechers, so they're gonna be great. They're a size 12, uh, so that's coming out of toddler into kid size. 
perfect for um, Christmas pictures or dressing up or if you just have a, a, a little queen in the making that she wants to be sparkly and beautiful and she wants sparkly shoes these are going to be for her and then last but not least I love this so much it is a size 2 it's a Disney raincoat from Monsters Inc and it's Monsters University the hood is what is so cute it has the how cute are those how cute is this your munchkin will look adorable in it it snaps in the front it's got a full thermal lining it is absolutely adorable I don't know if it's ever been worn because it sure doesn't look like it um, but it will be going up on Poshmark and I think that is just too too cute so good finds, right? I mean, Kate Spade boots, are you kidding me? And the Lucky Brand ankle boots, my favorite. Some beautiful clothes, some kids stuff. I'm having a blast doing this. I hope you're enjoying watching, seeing all these treasures and you're saying ooh and ah. If you want to tell your friends or family about me to follow me and see if they like some of the things I find, I would love that. Uh, leave me some comments below. Tell me how I'm doing. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you want to see. Tell me what you want me to shop for because I'll go find it. I'm on a mission. I appreciate you coming back and watching these videos. Thank you so much and have a phenomenal day as whatever that loud truck out there is doing. I'm sure you hear it. <laughs> Thank you. Have a great day.